East Africa Social Television. My name is Juliana Yitin to the East Africa Social. Magic's anger denies claiming rights to Tanasha's song of Sawa. Hexacop is claiming rights to the beats allegedly sampled by radio presenter turned singer Tanasha Donna in her latest song Sawa. Now according to Hexacop, a producer Magic's anger, who in early June took down uh, Tekashi 16's music video of Goba from YouTube for copyright infringement and uh, whom they claim to represent, owns Sawa samples. Claims were denied by anger, who via Instagram distanced himself from the alleged copyright strike, saying he has never engaged nor is he affiliated to the hexacop my attention is drawn to the fact that a certain company named hexacop has claimed rights of the sour song by Tana Sharona on my behalf under her youtube i wish to state that i'm not associated with and have not engaged this company to manage my rights and i don't have any rights in the song he said um Terming the move by the company as fraud, the Magix, the Ma Magix Empire CEO condemned the Hexacop for using his name to scam artists. Taking someone's rights to their song is theft and pretending to represent someone is fraud. Hexacop, keep my name out of your scam and stop messing with the work of hardworking artists, he added. In a rejoinder and... Uh, Quite shocked by the claims, Donna, on her part, bashed the company for, you know, just wanting attention. People are crazy out here, man, she wrote. The song in question was released on the 29th day of May 2020. And, um, of course, it is big on YouTube. It is a huge song. It has a number of, of um, views. I was checking to see how many views it actually has over 1.2 million views on YouTube and it's not even a month old. In the song Donna Celebrates Life, see all the good things come from the bad things. If you are not in the mood, better get into your groove because when you do, you feel the energy. Now this comes barely a week after Tanasha Donna claimed that Tanzanian music star Diamond, whom they have a son together, wanted to be paid to attend her Donatella EP launch on january 31st 2020 she actually made this announcement while having an interview with one big ugandan television called nbs tv now according to the song but their representative uh, terms deferred on pay among other issues that led to platinum failing to show up it was a lot to do with when business and love meet there is always issues that's why they said don't mix business and pleasure because something always seems to go wrong somewhere she narrated so I can say it was an issue with the management in terms of payment and a lot of other things that came behind it, but it was more business related as to why he decided not to show up at last minute. Oh my God. I think someone just wants um, uh, to, this hexacop wants to cause issues between Tanasha and this other guy uh, of um, uh, Magic's anger. It is just completely fraud. Like, why would you assume someone else has owns these rights when they clearly say they don't? And you're not even, they're not associated to you. I think that is really, really bad. People need to style up and look for better ways to make money. My name is Juliana. It's the East Africa Social. Do stick around for more stories about your celebrities. Bye for now.